Hello everyone, this is Unafraid Bites, welcome back to Final Fantasy XVI. Today we are going to explore this area with Jill. So let's do this shit! I'm laughing because I'm watching Pandora. I'm pussy master. How about you, Clive? <laughs> He's the bitch master because I'm a turtle. Let me just see if there's anything here worth exploring. Ah, oh, there's a dude there. I wanna try and fight with her by my side. Food after the stand, Pandora. Let's fight this bitch as well. <laughs> And bloody hides! <laughs> you dominated the beast! Perfectly! Now give her a kiss, Clive. Or a nice rep. She was very helpful! She was. As a rep. Ah, so many birds. What the chocobos? Chocobos! didn't seem the highest priority. Oi! Stop! Oi! Here, you couldn't give me an hand, could you? Typical. A bloody bearer. And just when I thought my luck had changed. Still, better a crumb of crystal than an empty hand, I suppose. Though it pains me to use another man's branded. Here, you understand me, don't you? I need your help. These blasted birds must have caught a whiff of my cargo, and now they've got me surrounded. <laughs> As funny glitch as it was. I've got something special needs delivering before the rest, but I dare not leave my cart untended. You couldn't run it up to Martha's rest for me, could you? Well, needs to get there a quick mind. We need to go there, so yeah, might as well. Fine. That's Since we're going there. Alright. Here. 
You hand that to the stable master and no one else. I'm owed a little something for it. If he gives it to you, pass it along to your master by way of thanks. How's the PC? Be off with you then. And don't it's go taking the any detours on the way. Let's prioritize this quest. Isn't the name itself Chocobo, right? Chocobo. Remind you of uh, Chocopic? Ch yeah, or a chocolate dessert. Yeah. A chocolate snack. Is it, yes, it does. Why are you reminding me of that bitch? Because I'm going downstairs. <laughs> Is there I'm chocolate going to downstairs? Get... Do you buy chocolate? No. Rice cookies. Uh, fuck you. Rice cookies. Bird wants. <laughs> ah. Search for Windows Assistant. Okay, fine. Ah! And shut up! And you shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Martha's doesn't breast. even have salt! You already have lots of salt in your cell. <laughs> Conjure it! <laughs> and it's not! <laughs> okay. One of the quests is there. Hello! That's one of all brand. Are you the stable master? I was asked to deliver this to you. This is for me, right enough. Not sure what some bearer is doing bringing it to me, though. Where's that fool of a peddler got to? He couldn't come himself. His cart surrounded by wild chocobos. Hmm. Huh. Sounds about right. I'll have it full of Gizal greens, no doubt. Crammed with him, if I know him. Gizal greens? Chocobos go mad for them, don't they? And if you forget to seal the cart up tight, the smell gets out, and birds come running from miles around. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, they're a fine investment for a savvy merchant, especially around these parts. But you can't get greedy, as our mutual friend is learning the hard way. Still, I got my wares, and that's all that matters. Be sure to pass your master my regards. He is not my master, but okay. Quest complete. Nice. What the world wants? <laughs> okay, where is the other... Okay, I'm coming. Not sure where is the other... Good girl, you get some rest. Can I mount you? <laughs> Can I ride you? Nothing. Rather good! <laughs> you barely have to step. I know that I can fast travel, but I want to see everything. You are a voyeur. I am. I wonder if Martha is as friendly as Gav claims. Let's go and find out, shall we? Ah. Very good to eat, Paul, even in the park. Where is the search for Bull Mills assistant at Galtens Bales? Where the hell is it? Shit. Hello, Here. villager. Has this thing always been glowing? Nah, it's just me. Uh, is that a chest? What is this? No? Oh no. So much for all parts of the Empire being equal, if that's all the crystal they give us. Oh, and it's not like any of us lowborn can afford a bearer anymore. I'm a bearer, but forget about it. Forget about it! Yeah, let's go in. Hello!
feel like excuse me would you happen to be the landlady depends who's asking and why they have an imperial bearer with them for protection which hopefully won't be needed if you can advise me on the safest route to the west it's your friend here I'd be worried about Bearers don't have an easy time of it in Rosaria. Even a Stratton lad like him might attract the wrong kind of attention. And if he gets nabbed, it ain't likely to end well for you either. Then we'll just have to stay out of the militia's way. Gav said you might be able to help us. <clears throat> Follow me. Nice. Gav's name, opening doors. Sorry for before. Can't be too wary of strangers asking questions in our game. I'm Martha, an old friend of Sid's. Old he said he friend? had high hopes for a bearer who joined recently. I expect that's you. So, where is it you're headed? For Phoenix Gate. We have questions that need answering. Is that so? Well, if you want to avoid the garrison, the road through Eastpool's your best bet. Or it would be, if the bridge hadn't collapsed. A right blooming nuisance it is. We've had no trade with the village for weeks. I did ask our carpenter to take a look at it. But he went out on another job. And he hasn't come back. Do you think something might have... happened to him? Fingers crossed he's just taking his time. The alternative don't bear thinking about. We'll find him. And make sure he's safe. We both need that bridge repaired. And your carpenter sounds like the man to do it. I see why Sid's got such a soft spot for you. If you could, I'd be in your debt. You said that he went out on a job? Right. He went down into the marshes to check on another bridge. The one by the Fallen Gate. The marshes were dangerous at the best of times. We should hurry. There's a ladder to the side of the gate. That's the quickest way down, if you've a head for heights. His name is Bernard. Should you find him well, tell him Martha sent you. And that he's wanted at the bridge to Eastpool. Okay, it's Bernard Tyson. Find a Bernard. To the marshes, then. Let's find that ladder. I was just <laughs> checking if any <laughs> doors were open to the. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I haven't bet you today yet. Wait, 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 wait. I want to bet you. I want to bet you. Ah, there you go, there you go, there you go. Get it, boy! Or a treat. <laughs> okay, good to go. It was good, honest work building the hack. Find Bernard building bridges, I'm guessing it's. Can't go there, I have to go there by foot. Very good to East Pool. Here's the gate. And, and that must be the ladder. Go. Thank you, my lady. You saved my life. 
not at all. <clears throat> You're Bernard the carpenter. He yes? was right there. Oh, I am. Nobody could help him. I, I didn't realize was, my name was known so widely. <laughs> I'm a friend of Martha's. She asked us to come and find you. <laughs> well, I'm very grateful <laughs> for it. She's always on I just the finished edge. Yeah. Like files when living I on the around, edge. I see a gang of slavering monsters looking to, to feast on my flesh. If you hadn't come when you did, I'd have been snipped into strips by now. We're just glad you're safe. Oh, I best go and give my regards to the landlady then, eh? Actually, she asked that if we found you, we should beg you make haste to repair the bridge to Eastpool. Of course. I, I said I'd take a look at it, but it, it clean slipped my mind. I'll head up there straight away. But do it straight away. my mind. It probably took them many and left. Fix it, bitch. Fix it. Ah, the trusses are still sturdy. It's just a matter of replacing the stringers and relining the deck. I'll have it done in no time. Thank you, Bernard. We were hoping to take the road to Eastpool ourselves. We're very grateful for your help. And sorry for asking this of you after what you've been through. I owe you my life. Oh, she's so kind. Fixing a bridge is Makes at least like a feel like a brute. Thank you, my dear. <laughs> Just yeah, fix it, bitch. And she's like, well, thank Sid, you so yeah. much for taking the time. Go way back. <laughs> and they're like, oh, well, as far as yeah, yeah. Line, but Thank you, I guess. Far enough. <laughs> People are decent. <laughs> yeah, so. Well, I best get cracking then. You go and let Martha know I'm all right. Yeah, you go break, break, break your skull. Thank you. What's this? Oh, it's my boot. Okay. Report back to Mars. The bridge will be fixed when it's fixed, right? <laughs> okay. Where am I going? I'm taking the longest You ain't pulled route. that sword from it, Scab. I'm taking the longest route. Where am I going? I'm an idiot. Anna, you're not an idiot. You're just a woman. And you're dumb. Yep. Yeah, because I'm a man. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? What did, did you find Bernard? <laughs> we did. He's fine. And he'll have the bridge to Eastpool repaired soon. Well, thank the Founder for that. It was lucky we found him when we did. The creatures out there are not to be trifled with. It's the Blight's fault. They had nothing to eat in the North, so they come down here hunting for food. He can't keep going out alone. I'll have to arrange a guard for him. But anyway, thank you. I don't have a lot to offer in return, but you're welcome to rest here until the repairs are finished. Oh, thank you. We'd be delighted. Another quest complete. Can I get you a drink or anything while you wait? Flagon of Imperial Gold, perhaps? Tastes like swill, but it'll slake a thirst. No, thank you. I prefer the truth about why there are so few bearers around here. Yes, there were more of them when we were young. Far more. Is this the Empire's doing? Have they been sent away? They have, I. Either to the Legions or Auriflam. Seems the miners at Drake's Head are having a hard time keeping up with demand of late. So the bearers make up the shortfall. Time was they used to dole out crystals like sugar plums even down here in the provinces, but not anymore. Nowadays, they'll jump at any excuse to confiscate our bearers so they can be put to work elsewhere. I always knew the Empire treated their branded like shit, but after seeing it with my own eyes, well... Congratulations on the new arrival. And you got the little laddie with you? It was a bearer. The boy I carried for nine long moons. 
A bloody bearer. Oh, you poor thing. You gave it to the constables then. Just left it at the garrison, I. Let them deal with it. Couldn't wait to be rid of the blasted thing. Been wanting it gone since the moment I found out. Well, it's all dealt with now. So no harm done, eh? Mum, you weren't my brother, was it? No. But you'll have one soon enough. You just have to be patient. All right? All right. Oh, hell. <clears throat> Unbelievable, isn't it? Bearers may have been looked down on back in Archduke Elwyn's day, but they were still human beings. Now they've fallen so far, a beggar wouldn't spit on them. Since you're not drinking, do me a favour and take that to the Abbey. There's a darkness at the heart of this world, and I'd have you see it. And we'll see it at an Abbey? Glademond Abbey, on the shore of Sorrowise Bay. The Abbot there is a friend. Tell him Martha sent you, and he'll show you what I mean. Understood. Okay. Leather punch. Oh, hello. <clears throat> what are you after? Nice. No, no. No. I have them all, apparently. Can I sell this one? I wanted one of those. That all, is it? Okay. Yeah. That all. Come and have a look! Don't be shy! Fresh cuts! Fresh cuts! Get your fresh cuts! It's over here. Oh, nice. An elevator. Good. Oh, here. Yeah. Like this cool. The children were tested. That a bearer's fate was decided at birth. And assumed it was best for all concern. I know. Did you think it's a child to be blamed. To be hated Hello. by its parents through no fault of its own. We knew nothing of what it meant to be born that way. Did we? No. There's another thing over there. I might need There's it. There's the Abbey. A darkness awaits us within, I wonder. Let's go and see. Yeah, yeah, let's go. I'm just checking it out. Sorry about that. Sorry about not giving a crap. Nice. The Abbey. day to you. I'm afraid the Abbey is not open for public prayer. May Grieger go with you? We came to offer a donation. From Martha. <sighs> I see. Then please, follow me. Show us, show us the darkness that Martha was telling us about. 
these people Martha's bearers she entrusted them to my care that I might ease their suffering to the extent that I can for the time they have left to petrifying the hell? Or is it, uh, is it a blight or The curse has taken them. All of them. As it does every bearer forced to use their gift. With each draw on the ether, their bodies petrify, till all that remains is stone and pain, and so they are cast aside. There is nothing either Martha or I can do to change that. But we can at least strive to make their final hours a little more bearable. <laughs> Have faith, my son, for you shall rise again and find the happiness denied you in this life. Thank you, Father. Shit, man. <laughs> oh, this one is going to the hell. I must offer you my own thanks for the medicine you so kindly brought. Now that their final moments may be moments of peace. Mass is a good one. When next you see Martha, pray tell her that two more have succumbed. Man, this is dark shit. Follow the light. We should get back to Martha's rest. Yes. Fuck. We should. But back to Martha. It was good, honest work what? building the aqueduct. On dressing greens of Gizal. Never down raw, less bitter juices, inspire violent retching and loose bowels. <laughs> Avoid the frying pan, less foul stink taint the, the iron, rendering it none better than slag. And by no means put to stew, less the vapors over excite stable bows. If suffer the father one must <laughs> first mix with nine parts Drake's mint, six parts lemon peel, or three parts ginger root and soak it soak in honeyed wine for a quarter moon to lessen melodor. Nice to know. What's that? The following cheatery will be repaid with a swift boot to the arse. <gasps> Mucking, stacking, pecking, picking, palming, foisting, fingering. What the fuck is even this <laughs> fingering? Ah, Did you're back. What? Thanks for taking care of that. The abbot had a message for you. Two more have succumbed. I see. Come upstairs. So, now you know, eh? 
I've seen plenty of bearers die on the battlefield. But never like that. And all because they were born different. The powers that be can't take away their gift, so they strip them of their humanity instead. Oh, there's plenty who pity a bearer's plight. But so long as we're content to sit around, weeping for those on whose broken backs we're carried, we ain't gonna change nothing. And so you lend Sid your strength? What little of it I have. Used profits from this place to buy the poor buggers. So when the abbot told us the bearers were yours? Aye, they're my property, at least by law. Any still fit to work fetch a price beyond my means. All I can do is care for those who are past mending. But it's not all doom and gloom. Bernard's finished fixing that bridge for you. You can carry right, on let's... to Eastpool now. You got questions that need answering, ain't you? Well, I wish you luck. Thank you, Martha. Oh, I almost forgot. Sid and I have other friends in Rosaria. Wear this, and they'll know you for one of us. Seal obtained. Okay. Slumbering chocobo. I know that you will always be welcome here. I like that seal. You Thank were you right, Sid. It really is them. Lord Rosfield and Lady Warwick have come she back knows. to us. And long may they stay. She knows. She knows. And she fingers. I don't think she fingers. Someone does. It's it. Sid. Ah, Clive. You're not where I oh, left boy. you. Hurt your hand. His arm. I did, aye. With a thousand little lightning bolts. Can't fling them around the way I used to. Think of it as my decoration for long service and exemplary misconduct. Come here to compare war wounds. We didn't. Thank you, Sid. For everything. <laughs> if you want to leave, that's your lookout. I'm sure you'll have a long and happy life together if you stay out of my way. Sid! <laughs> oh. I knew a girl, back in the day. She was a slave to her fate, just like you. I wanted to save her. Is he talking about Benedicta? <laughs> For a while, I even thought I could. But just because you think something doesn't make it true. Sid. Saviour. Just a conceited old fool. I talk about people forging their own futures, but instead of handing them the hammer, I beat them with my own. And if no bugger wants to listen to what you've got to say, you might as well keep your gob shut. But Clive, I will say this. a monster. You're the same man you've always been. Accept that, and you may yet escape your fate. My fate? Look, lad, you've had a hard life, and I don't see it getting much easier. 
might not be able to save anyone else. But at the very least, you can save yourself. <laughs> I'll try. And Jill. I'm sorry we didn't get a chance to talk. But I trust you'll take good care of the boy. <laughs> yes, I will. Is that the last of it? Aye. We'd best head back then. Wouldn't want to keep Nan waiting. Ta -ra, then. I like Sid. I love his voice. It's pretty good. All these characters are a delight to play with and play as. Don't you agree? Yes, I do agree. All of them. All of them. You're probably saying something dirty. But I don't care. I wasn't this time, but now that you mentioned it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God damn it. <laughs> or wouldn't this be a role playing game? <laughs> An action one this time. Let me just do this real quick. Oh, a quickie. A quickie. Nice. It's now! Ah, there it is. Okay. Someone's in trouble. No, not there. Check the abilities, by the way. Oh, hello! It would have been worse if you hadn't come along. Wait, uh, I've seen you around the hideaway. You're new, aren't you? I'm Clive. And I'm Martel. But what are you doing here? Looking for you. This is no place for a bearer on her own. I noticed that. But this soil's not going to collect itself. Then what if I gathered it for you? You could head back to the hideaway. Just exactly what sort of dirt is it that you need? What I need is soil. But I'd be a fool to refuse your help after what just happened. It's the good stuff you're looking for. Dark, rich, fragrant. You'll mm. know it when you find it. Dark, rich and fragrant. Right. Well, you should hurry the back. Has more vitamins. Bohemil seemed worried enough that he might come looking for you himself. That seems unlikely. But I won't argue with you. Thanks. You'll we'll grow a dead man's toe in there. <laughs> Soil then. Soil There's then. There's certainly enough of it here. But is it dark, rich, and fragrant? Now I'm gathering soil. It could be worse. Could be worse. To be in the call center. We're <laughs> gathering shit. It's still better. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, right? Oh no, one more to go. Where is it? Ah, there. 
There you go. You make it look so easy. This should be enough. <laughs> I better get it back to the hideaway. Either way, it is not what I meant. The wrong key. Either way. Okay, here is your poopy soil. Filled with minerals and shit. I want a nectar! I want nuts. That's a lot of nuts. And all safe and sound. Oh, yeah, she's standing right there. Not the girl. The soil. <laughs> uh, yes. <laughs> Here. It's concerned about the soil. It's good enough. Glorious! When Martel came home empty-handed, I almost had a fit. But with this, with this, my research can continue. First and foremost come the measurements. I must know how much ether each sample contains. From there... Wait, so you were never... Worried about me? Sorry to disappoint you, but the only thing he worries about is his research. But that's oh, it. That's all right. It's just how he is. And if it wasn't for him, we wouldn't be growing anything in these ruins. It's a small price to pay. Although, you shouldn't have to pay it too. Did he even offer you anything for helping? Ugh. Here. I know it's not much, but it's something, at least. You shouldn't take it, but okay. He's taking it. Okay. I wish I could offer you some fruit too, but you're not likely to thank me if I do. Still. We'll grow something worth eating one of these days, and when we do, you'll have first pick. Oh, nice. Apples? Quest complete! Dust to dust. Soil to soil. Soil to soil. Apples to apples. <laughs> now, my research can continue <laughs> pace. <laughs> 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 Ah, the bridge. It's done. Don't you worry about the boards. I use good solid lumber. It's the base on the other side you want to be careful of. Martha said the blight had spread even further south, pushing yet more monsters down with it. I dare say we'll be seeing a few along the way. Yeah. Then we shall have to keep our wits about us. I keep going towards them because I want to pick up this shit. Is the one back at the hideaway. Apparently. Doesn't seem to be working though. Kick it! Or maybe not. I'm just checked the abilities by the way. Haven't purchased, purchased some in a while. I only have 503. Well, shit. Uh, slice down. This one is good. Oh, and this one here to imbue. Let's go with this one. Here, yeah, imbue. In the slice, where the hell not? No, could have done that one too. In time, in time. You there, over here. Frederick. Excuse me, I'll use that blade of yours. Curse my luck, I branded. No time to haggle with whoever holds your leash. Wait. That's the slumbering chocobo you're wearing. You in the Marfers, are you? Good. 
She won't begrudge me the use of you, then. Not while there's wolves about. We tried dealing with them ourselves. Made out bait, think we might swoop in and slaughter a lot. But we didn't expect the pack to be quite so bloody big. I expect the Blight drove them here. They must have fled their homes for greener pastures. Well, we'd hoped empty bellies might make them easy prey. We'd made them mean instead. Martha's no fool, so she must see something in you. Do us a favor and get rid of them, will you? Fine. All right. I suppose those walls pose a threat to everyone. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. I'd wager the greedy bastards are still over yonder, finishing off our bait. When you've seen to every last one of them, go and speak to my friend over the bridge. Bryce, his name is. He want to know if he's safe to come across. All right, off you go then. There we go again. The side quests starting to look like Witcher 3 side quests. <laughs> I always remember that with the... We had to wait <laughs> on the door while they did it. And you could hear them. <laughs> Doing it. Ah, this is a nice little trick. Are you Bryce? What's it to you, Bearer? Your friend asked me to get you rid of the You can cross wolves, the bridge now. So I got rid of the wolves. You'd have me believe a single bearer slew the entire pack. Yeah, I'm special. And again, if you didn't, you wouldn't be on this side of the bridge. Bugger me, you're a tough one, aren't you? <laughs> oh, Frederick! You oily bastard. I never thought to pit beast against beast like that. You served us well, Bearer. Be sure to pass our thanks to your master. Quest complete! Thanks for the money, bitch. I love windmills. I want to live in a windmill. <laughs> What's a windmill? Is it beans? Hmm? Wit. Quiet. Too far fetched. Isn't it? Too far fetched. Yes. You. You're Clive Rossfield. It's me, Hannah, Rodney Murdoch's wife. Lady Hannah. Oh, I knew it was you. You haven't changed at all. The Lord Marquis and Jill too. It's so good to see you both again. 
It's good to see you too, Lady Hannah. Lady Hannah, I don't remember her. <gasps> Give that woman a bar of chocolate. She needs it. Her name is Anna as well. She needs the chocolate. <laughs> If you have time, you simply must come back to the house. I haven't much to offer, but what is mine is yours. Hmm. We should be delighted. She's so cute. Bye bye. <laughs> Always. 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 Bye bye. And you have been wandering the world ever since. I can well understand fleeing from those iron blood brutes. But oh, and brutes. to take to the road at such a tender age. It uh, wasn't easy. We survived, and... And now we're back. It's wonderful to see you safe and well, Lady Hannah. It doesn't look well. Do you think you will stay here? in Eastpool. Rosaleth still enjoys the Mother Crystal's blessing, does it not? You could always move. This house holds a lot of memories for me. So long as I can live here in peace, here I shall stay. Not that it matters. The capital is closed to civilians, by order of the Duchess. Or should I say, Her Imperial Majesty. Annabella's marriage to the Emperor of Sambrec heralded a great many changes here. Yes. Of course. Oh, forgive me. I... I didn't mean to... Oh. Please. There is nothing to forgive. Would my mother not make an exception for you and your husband? Surely she would not refuse the Lord Commander. You haven't heard, then. Rodney passed away on the night of the fire. He never returned from Phoenix Gate. I didn't? I... I'm sorry. Clive. My poor child. You look pale. All this traveling must have taken its toll. I insist you rest. We can talk later. Hmm? Are you sure you don't want to sleep inside? I can't. Not after what I did. Lady Hannah said she would prepare a change of clothes for you in the morning. She really has been very kind. Is it not? <laughs> I don't think so, this. Yes. Thirteen years of killing. It is. It is. Thirteen years without the faintest glimmer of hope. It was only Joshua that kept me going. I swore that I would avenge his death. That I would kill his killer. That was the only thing that gave my life any meaning. If it was me who killed Joshua and Murdoch and all the others, 
And why the hell am I still breathing? I ask myself the same. When I fought, hundreds died. There were so many bodies, so many lives cut short in their prime. That day in Dalmechia, I... I wanted to join them. I wanted it all to end. I couldn't bear it anymore. If living meant being that, better to be just another body. on the balcony when we looked up at the moon I said a prayer to Metia and that prayer was answered hmm. oh you came back to me I told you the heavens must have a plan for us Lean in! Lean in! What the? What the hell? A heart of stone. We should get some rest. Why didn't he lean I... in? <gasps> Last time Night. someone rejected Night. a woman in his game. <laughs> Shit happened. Jeff! Jeff! Sleep well. Yeah. She's probably gonna be gone in the morning, bitch. What did you do? You like her? What the hell is wrong with you? She leaned in. You don't refuse a lean in. If you like her. If you don't, okay. Thank you, Mediana. Oh, she was still there in Perhaps the morning. Now people will not Lucky flee bitch. Of me. You look just like Elwyn did when he was your age. I'm fuming. How did you come I want some of my see father's old clothes? Oh, before Elwyn, ah, the clothes Archduke. from the Our families would often summon main together. menu. <laughs> he and Rodney were like brothers. Nice. These clothes have been in a wardrobe for years, collecting cobwebs along with everything else. Well, I'm very grateful for them. And sorry for depriving you of your memories. Not at all. It's what your father would have wanted. They suit you well. Awkward. <laughs> thank you, Lady Hannah. Yes, thank you. You've been most kind. No, I should thank you. It may only have been for a short while. But seeing you again took me back to happier times. Fare you well. My lord and lady. And you, Lady Hannah. She's so cute. Bye bye. <laughs> okay, everyone. If we Jennifer follow her along to the north, Jennifer Lawrence. Take us all the way to Phoenix Gate. <laughs> nah, this is Let's cuter. <laughs> the uh, Jennifer Lawrence is a more of a naughty face. More of a blind. Face. Blind act. That viral shit that she paid to delete. <laughs> oh, my boobs are blind. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, okay. I always remember. Of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> okay, everyone, I'm gonna stay here for today. I mad they didn't kiss, didn't lean in. Maybe he thought it wasn't the right time. No, I thought it no, was the right time. Sid I don't convinced him to oh. Sides. To switch sides. No, no, I don't think so. I think he is like... Whatever, it doesn't <laughs> matter. <laughs> I'm still upset. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.